Hey guys, it's Scott from Channel Zero, your digital marketing MBA. And uh, hey, check the shirt out. Yeah, no political affiliation. I'm just a hustler. I don't care who you put in office. Hey, uh, man, listen, guys, I'm not negative ever. I'm a firm believer in exercising the positive, staying focused on the positive. I don't get in no drama. Um, I don't like to fight. But uh, I do want to protect you guys, and I do want to protect our clients. I do want to protect this industry. So when I see stuff like this, I think occasionally I wouldn't name names. I wouldn't call nobody out. But I, I want to point it out to make sure that you guys are aware of it and that customers are aware of it, that we protect the industry, we, we protect each other. Um, so I was watching a video and somebody was uh, somebody who does social media marketing, but they also uh, sell courses, was trying to teach in their video on how to get one cent clicks on Facebook, Instagram, et cetera. Listen, I've been doing this for a few years now. Um, this isn't new to me. And the market has changed in the U.S. especially. And it's very difficult to get one cent clicks or better. It's it's a rarity. Um, and this person was trying to sell it as, as, you know, it was pretty pretty easy, you know, that they do it all the time. So basically, at the beginning of the video, I took a screenshot. And here's where they were showing, right here, one cent clicks. Okay, and they're going to show you how to do that. Look at all those clicks. So I don't know if they did that for themselves or if they did it for a client. Um, but what they then I, I watched on in the video and I took a screenshot of the next slide. And these are the countries they targeted. They were setting up an ad to show you how to do it. And they said, of course, we use the big four. And they went to the big four English speaking uh, populations right here that they're probably marketing to whatever it was. But let me show you something right here. You see that I N? That's India, okay? That's not what they chose in the big four. You go to India, you go to Brazil, you go to some of these other large populated countries with a lot of people on Facebook, you're going to get one cent clicks really easy. It's not a problem. But And I don't have a problem with that. There's a time and a place to do that. Um, it's called social proof. When you need to build something up and you want to have a lot of likes and comments and shares on a photo uh, before you start selling it, I've done it with t-shirts quite a bit. You get a lot of likes on there. You get a thousand likes on there, 500 likes on there, bunch of shares. Then when people see it roll through their feed, um, they don't necessarily go in and see who liked it, but they say, wow, you know, 500, that must be a popular shirt. It helps grab attention. It builds social proof. Uh, I'm fine with that. If you're building some social proof for a company's uh, Facebook page and you want to have a lot of likes on there before you start running ads, I'm fine with it. But here's what I'm not fine with, and this is what upsets me. Number one, don't you dare go out and tell a local restaurant owner or somebody you're going to get them clicks, you're going to get them exposure, you're going to get them likes, and you get them you know, for a penny because you've done it for other customers and you get them a thousand page like or two thousand clicks on the ad, and it's from India. I mean, don't do that, guys. Come on. Take, don't and, and if you're a small business owner, don't let these social media guys take advantage of you by doing stuff like this. I, I can't stand this junk. And the second thing is, if you're going to sell a course, don't tell people that in that course that you can teach them how to easily get the one cent clicks, okay? And then be deceptive about the countries that you're using. Um, I, I'm just not for that, man. Don't take advantage of people. You're not going to get anywhere with that. I promise you, not in the long run. And you know, I mean, this is a screenshot from my phone that I wanted to show you guys. Look at this. 0. 0.004 was my engagement cost. Uh, 2,909 video views on $12 spent. Uh, reached 8,000 people less than a penny. So I could run a, a video showing you how to get less than a penny and I could, I guess I should be selling a course on e-commerce and, and I should be taking this to customers and saying, look, it won't even cost you a penny to get somebody to look at a video about your restaurant. No, I wouldn't do that. It's deceptive. And you know what this is? This is a video I ran. Uh, I sell products in Brazil. And right now, Brazil, it's what it's what the U.S. was a few years back when you could get those kind of uh, prices. But it's super, super, super difficult if possible now. I'm sorry, but it is. 
Um, and, and, but this is, you know, I sell products overseas, Europe and Brazil. And this is one of my ads recently from Brazil, but I'm not going to hide that from you. And I'm not going to tell you that I can easily teach you how to do that. You know what else I have? Uh, I have a Brazilian wife that helps me. You know what else I have? I speak the language. I'm bilingual. I speak Portuguese. Um, so those things help me in copywriting and, 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 uh, going overseas and doing these things, but in, in no way would I ever try to sell a course based on this deception and you guys need to watch out for this stuff man a lot of these guys they're uh, they're making their money off the courses they make one two three thousand dollars a month from social media marketing and they're making ten thousand dollars a month selling their courses i'm just telling you that's that's where all the fancy cars and trips and stuff is coming from from you buying the courses I'm not against courses. My computer's full of courses. A lot of them got my money, but I know they're making a ton of money from the courses, not not from what they're teaching you to do. I promise you that you can make a living and you can make good money doing what they're teaching you to do. I'm not saying that, but I'm telling you they're making most of that wealth, most of them from the courses, which is why everybody eventually ends up doing courses. Um, but but so listen. That's. I just wanted to share that with you. I want to make sure that that we protect uh, the reputation of the industry. I want to make sure that the people who watch my videos don't let some social media uh, manager, social media marketing joker, snake oil salesman take advantage of them. And and any of you guys that watch my stuff because you're trying to learn how to be social media marketers or help your customers, that that. Uh, you don't take advantage of them and you don't get taken advantage of by these these people selling these snake oil courses that's it man so uh on a on a positive note get back to the hustle and uh be encouraged man stay safe out there if you got any questions uh you can ask me but i just want to make sure that uh you guys stayed blessed stay protected and nobody got over on you all right have a good night